Hi friends, we're in Palm Jumeirah and uh, this is a house tour to one of the villas in Palm Jumeirah and we have a special guest, Katie. She will describe us regarding this villa. Please, Kathy. Well, we're beginning on the private beach, which is attached to the villa. As you can see, all the front has its own private beach. Um, this one's very actively used by the children of the villa. With all their trampolines and their climbing frames and so forth. Walking up the stairs to the garden at the back side of the villa. Very well manicured garden with a small pool to the side. And more toys. So this is the lounge living area, very comfortably done. And you have a space for a 10-seater dining table and chairs, obviously. Floor to ceiling windows, brings in a lot of light into all of the room. We're here at 11 o'clock in the morning. This also keeps it nice and shaded as well. We're in the kitchen now. Kitchen with many, many fitted cupboards and counter space. Also room for a dining table and chairs. And also all the white goods are here as well. Nice marble floored hallway. Very high ceilings. All the doors are heavily in wood with the glass effect throughout them. This is the first room, which as you can see, the occupants of the house use it as a lounge living area. Very relaxed room. This is the study. As you can see, he has bookcases on either side, table, computer, etc. And then we have a guest bathroom. So it's a separate doorway into the WC, and the sink is outside. Marble staircase. Nice size hallway. L shaped. Go first into should do that. Mm -hmm. away separate from any other room. We have what they use as the baby of the house room. Double bedroom with ensuite bathroom. Fitted wardrobes. and a window looking out onto the beach and their private pool.
Second bedroom, bigger than the first bedroom we saw, the children's room, en suite with VD. Plenty of storage space here. They use this obviously as the guest bedroom, as uh, patio doors leading out onto the front of the community, and a very Nice size balcony, terrace. Storage. And. Just in case room. Tidy way. A hub, yeah, a cubby hole. Master bedroom. That's the design of the windows, bringing quite a lot of light and look out onto the beachfront and the villas opposite. Sunken baths. Shower, walk in shower, and the way to the WC and B day. Plenty of fitted wardrobes. Bedroom number four. Again has a door leading out onto the balcony overlooking the beach. And an ensuite bathroom and fitted wardrobes as well. So this one, they have a false ceiling. And again, the last bedroom, bedroom number five. All very good sized rooms. All bedrooms have en suites. This one is another bathroom en suite. This is probably the worst bedroom of the lot, really, because there's no view either side at a minimum. Windows. Nice feature about the Palm Villas is their very high ceilings and the circular windows, arch windows. 